going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video on Scoops World and it's your boy Scoop. And today we have the 2020 NBA Drafts Top 10 Most Exciting Guards in their high school highlights. So we all know the draft is tonight. I'm going to go ahead and hurry up and edit this video for you guys. It's the top 10 most exciting guards in the draft tonight with their high school highlights like I just said. If you're a person who loves the NBA, college basketball, high school basketball, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Comment below who you think is the best guard in this year's NBA draft is. Go ahead and leave a like for your boy. Stay tuned. It's yours. Like I said, 2020 NBA drafts, top 10 most exciting guards. Let's get into the video. Cole Anthony. Hey, Cole been quiet as of lately. Everybody know the mellow ball right here. Who we got here? Oh, Anthony Edwards. Okay, Anthony Edwards. Mm, stupid athletic. Woo, that boy dunking like Westbrook. Wait, go ahead, put him to sleep. Jumper. Hand down, man down. Mm, that boy didn't want to jump with you. Oh, good pass. Transition. That's a big boy. Like, he's built like James Harden. Uh, crossover. Mm, that pull up was so sweet. This is high school. Range. On game dollar time. Woo! Now everybody thinks um, he might go number one tonight. I mean, honestly, he should. If there's no trades. It's perfect for a Timberwolf. So they got their point guard already. They got their center. Oh my God. All right, we got, ooh, LaMelo Ball. Nice pass. Easy lay. Now LaMelo is, is my personal favorite uh, guard in this year's draft. 6'8", Penny Hardaway. Got the slinky. Got the jumper, playmaking ability, tall, so he can rebound. Like I said, that jumper is cash. Only thing is, like, he had to work on his defense, but I mean, he's gonna bring ticket sales in. And he's gonna, it's gonna be, it's gonna be crazy. All right, all three ball brothers, he's the best one. Look at that, playing with him, on easy pass. Um, only way he goes number one is if the Timberwolves trade that pick. Ooh. People got him going to the Hornets. Um, he's not going to the Warriors. So, he may go number one if the Timberwolves trade the pick. If not, I can see him going to the Hornets or the, the number four to the Bulls. That was a walk. Mm. And one ref. Cause he's legit 6'8", maybe, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't say maybe 6'9", but nah, 6'8", uh, Euro, no look. That was not travel. Post work, uh, fade away, Dirk. Dirk Nowitzki. Mm. He's athletic, not the most athletic, but he is athletic. Okay, it's the kid from Arizona, right? Yeah. Uh, lottery, Green, Josh Green. Uh, if not lottery, late first round. He is real good though. I can actually I can see him sneaking into the lottery. Josh Green, I can see Josh Green sneaking into the lottery. Like late lottery to mid twenties. Real good athlete, good shooter, bucket getter. He actually reminds me of 
Ooh. Mm. He reminds me of Devin Booker a little bit. But he's way more athletic than Devin Booker. Devin Booker ain't doing that. He's talking about how, how he has the offensive game come to him. Cole Anthony, man, he's been quiet lately in draft talks. Um, son of an NBA pro. Uh, athletic like Westbrook and Derrick Rose. Not the best shooter, but he can shoot it. He doesn't look athletic, but he is crazy athletic. They got him at 6'3". I don't know how, how true that is. But, um, like, in the beginning of the college season, they, oh, my God. Yeah, I'm going, like, on the top five picks. Now, for sure, first rounder, I think his ceiling is late lottery to late first. Mm, God, woo! Um, but yeah, man, I don't know why teams are sleeping on him now or like not as interested as before. Like I said, he was at one point a top five pick. Now, I think maybe because of the shooting. Because everybody knows he's athletic. Uh, I can see him going late lottery to late first round. He's definitely not going out in the first round, though. Great, he's a great point guard. Tough, heady, like a pit bull. You know what I'm saying? Got the handle floater. Little dunk on you. Look. Play defense. He's got to work on his jumper a little bit more. Look. What point guard is doing that? Fast. Hey, yo, like that. That's like a Derrick Rose Russell dunk he just did right there. Westbrook. All right, we got Nico Minion out of Arizona. Now, this kid is sneaky athletic. You know, you want to look at him and think he's athletic. I did a video on Nico a couple weeks ago. Go ahead and archive and check it out. He was ranked ahead of the Mellow Ball in high school. Now, Nico was like, uh, I call him like a little Steve Nash, man. Got the jumper, heady, handle, floater. I can see Nico definitely going in the first round. But not a lot. Uh, he might sneak in late lottery. But I, that's, that's definitely will be his ceiling. I think he'll be like a late first round draft pick though. He reminds me of the kid that went to Villanova and got and went draft the first round to the Bucks. Uh, DiVincenzo or something. I don't know his name. Something in Italian, I think. Everly ain't pan out too much. I think Nico will be like that. But I mean, Nico might pan out. He was he was he was ranked ahead of LaBella Ball in high school. He's a good offensive threat. If you play 2K, he's an offensive threat. And he will dunk on you. Heady, look, floater through contact. I like Nico a lot. I just, you know, there's point guards in this draft I think is better than him. I'm not saying he's not good though. Look at that. Who tracked the cannon the rock like that? Jumper. That was very contested. Look at that. Woo! I like that pull up. I like that pull up. Loader. That's a little heavy. Oh my! I see. I didn't think he would do that. It's sneaky, yo. Cassius Stanley. Went to Duke this year. He's a pure slasher. Athletic. Will dunk on you. Hustle. Uh, Two-way type of guy. Both ends of the floor. He's a guy that I can see go early second. But his ceiling will be late first. Um, went to Duke. Pretty productive. I, just, I think like, he needs to get his jumper up a little bit better. He reminds me of... Hmm... He's a, he's a slash for sure. I'm trying to think who he remind me of. So now we're getting to God trying to. So he wasn't a freshman this year. 
Mm, that was a tough take though. That was tough. Mm, mm. Woo. Pull it. They're playing the Boys and Girls Club? Get pretty good. I know he's not a one and done. Pretty good though. Mm. This kid looks like he's gonna be the steal of the draft. Mm. Yeah. He might be the steal. Easy. Lefty. Hey, I could have sworn I seen him shoot a jump with the right hand. Y'all are playing with people? Mm. Pretty good. Up and under. Got a high flyer right here, huh? Excuse me. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. This boy is dumping on everybody. You didn't want no parts of that? That boy built like a football player. So that was a little sneak peek of tonight's uh, top most exciting guards in the uh, NBA draft. Uh, we didn't get through all 10, but the, the few that we got through, yes, sir. Um, so again, man, if you're a person who loves the NBA draft, talk, the NBA, college basketball, high school basketball, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Like up the video and comment below who you think will be the top five guards drafted tonight, right now. Go ahead and comment. Till next time.